Good morning, still working on the pool at the Akoya? Yes, guys, it's still working on the Akoya, but the market on the Akoya is still good. So, good morning, we are here, I'm Fabrice, and we are here to do the analysis from the Akoya, this building that is localized at the 6365 and Collins Avenue, where you can do short-term rental with 30-day restriction. So, what's happened this week? But just a little reminder. 420 uh, apartments in total, and there is 48 floor, 11 apartments by floor. The, um, the building is built, uh, was built in 2004. So what's happened this week? We are talking about the weeks for the 18th of April until the 25th of April. So what's happened this week? Like you can see just here, 12 units for sale on this building. The market is, is still good. And you will see, you will see the analysis for this market, guys. There is a new unit, the 3304, two bedroom, two bathroom and all. So two here, the two days on the market, 1,298 for the square feet for the amount for the square feet and the price is 1.495 and after what we have we have a unit pending and we have a unit closed the market is good and also if, the, if there is a work why because it's a luxury building and the price is very nice and the HOA as well so let's check it out for this one the 2102 is a two bedroom two bathroom that the price was listed at 1.795 and it's just pending we will see exactly how much it will be closed. The price for the square footage is 1,289 and is on the market for a long time, 217 days. Let's see what's happened at the closing. So after you have the 1102, is a two bedroom, two bathroom, is that the price listed was 1.589 and is sold, is closed at 1.5. It's not bad for a two bedroom, two bathroom at the Akoya. And the square footage, the price for the square footage is 1,148. The market at the Akoya is still good. What's happened with the rent? The rent, there is, Sometimes people say, what's happening with the rent? There is a lot of units for rent. Why there is a lot of units for rent? Look at that. 35 units for rent. But look at this shit. Look at this Excel shit. What's happening? What's happened exactly that the people, when they put a unit for rent or for sale, when there is a problem and they stay on the market because it's overpriced, look at this here. We have three units that the price going down, but it's not going down for the few dollars. Look at that. There is the 2710, one bedroom, one bathroom. The price was 5,500, is dropping at 3,800. It's a 69 day on the market and the average price for the square footage is $5.61. It's unbelievable, guys. How is possible that the people is something at 5,500 and going down to 3,800 because the correct price is 3,800. Obviously, guys, if you want to rent your apartment, because you see, I take the example for that one, 69 days on the market is unbelievable. Unbelievable, two months, that almost three, that you will pay the HOA, you will pay all the things that you have to pay on the apartment and you don't have one penny and your apartment is still empty. It's not possible, so I cannot support that. I'm sorry, but it's always, 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 always the same thing. The people starting to overprice their apartment, they stay on the market for a long time, and after, because they are tired, and they want to go down. The job of your broker, of your real estate agent, it is to do the analysis for you because he's a professional. It is to do an analysis for you, explain to you exactly what's going on and what the, not what the price that is listed, but the price for the unit that is rented, that is a similar unit. And because you can see here for the other one, the other one that we have, the 4406, two bedroom, two bathroom, the price by 5,200 and 9,400. So the average price is $4.17. This is the average price that we have here in the Akoya. And you can see it. Go to my YouTube channel, click on subscribe, and you will see it exactly the analysis that we did for more than five years ago. And you will see exactly what's going on with the market because the market that it was yesterday is not the market that we are today and the market that is listed is not the market that is sold 
that is the thing that we have understand i can put my car that it costs fifteen thousand dollars at one hundred thousand dollars because but nobody will buy it obviously and if i put it at the real price at fifteen thousand dollars someone see this car that they like this typical brand he like it and they buy it this is exactly the same things for an apartment people waiting because when the price is overpriced or they move and they go to another unit because they want to pay the real price that the market so let's continue we have here the last one the 4309 two bedroom two bathroom the price is six thousand dollars and is at uh, 5900 now the average price five dollars thirty and see what's happened with this unit the last one is pending but look that guys you see listen because it's very very important that the last one that is pending look that this one is pending is pending the price was 6900 okay 6900 6900 okay so he put the price the agent put the price at 5000 this is the real real price this unit was on the market for 69 a day and now it's pending because the price is a real price but why to wait 69 days to have the same result than to have one unit that is empty for the 69 day and the average price like you can see here four dollars 34. guys if you want be connected by your professional you can call me you can text me you can send me a whatsapp we know really the market with no pretension we live here we did the analysis every single day and we will do every single week we do the analysis for this building and for several buildings here at the beach for more than five years ago and you can go to the youtube channel to see it click on my youtube channel active the ring like this you can receive a notice always when i put a video online is the video about the analysis for the different building but the analysis for the real estate market as well and we put the video from the interest rate what's going on the title company was going on the now was going on what's going on really in the real estate market here in miami not only for the resale unit but for the new construction as well which one is better to invest or which one is better to will to live if i want to move in miami and by the way we're working by with an immigration lawyer that he can help you we know exactly the market for the e2 and the eb5 that we did some conference in new york city and we will do you can keep you posted and my youtube channel and you will see the, the the next advertising that we will do the conference in new york city about the e2 and eb5 visa and the investment in real estate here in florida what the rent you can have what you can earn when you want to invest to protect your real estate exactly well how do you want and how many and how much money you want to make guys you can go by the way to the website of the Akoya www.akoyareport.us like this you can see exactly because we put all the report so every single week all the report on the website to get the analysis when you want to see it and you can download exactly the excel sheet to have for you an idea but the better way call me text me or send me a whatsapp i'm my personal number 786-603-0184 the technology is very very good but to get someone that he can talk to you one-to-one -one is better because everyone is a special people you are a case everyone have a different situation so don't hesitate to call us call us click on subscribe call me directly and i can do the analysis completely free to exactly if you want to buy an apartment and it's very very important to sell your apartment again if you want to sell something you cannot sell it for ten dollars it costs one dollar you have to be realist but you must to have the better price when you want to sell your unit and you must to have the better price when you want to buy it thank you for watching and see